All right, friends, subscribers, and internet strangers, what's up? So, with the yard sales by myself, poor Harlan had to go sell stuff. Went to the flea market by myself. What did I find? Am I good enough to find stuff by myself? This right here holds the answer. Are you excited? Do you want to see what I found? There's some lessons to be learned, and there's some gold that I found. Let's hit the button. All right, so we drove the trusty Sienna. Uh, I got Coke Zero. Yeah, y'all thought I'd give that up. I'm not that strong yet. <laughs> so the first two things right out the gate are gold. Uh, we'll get back to that one. This one here. Um, there's some things. This is a, this is an Overwatch set of headphones, gaming headphones. Um, they're a special. There's some things you so Overwatch is pretty popular. Should, that should get your curiosity. And this pink color is not the normal one either. But that right there, that symbol. You, if you're gonna sell electronics or resale, that's that's the symbol for Razer. R A Z I E R Razer. Uh, and it also says it right here. If you if you don't know the signal, the symbol. So they were actually never opened. The tape kind of broke whenever I was carrying around the flea market, which is very disturbing. Uh, the last pair of these gave $70 for them. Uh, I'll show you on the screen just a second what the last pair sold for. Uh, this pair of headphones, you're going to be shocked. All right. So now that you've recovered from that one, this one here. So what's the lesson to be learned with this guy here? If you're gonna sell electronics, you gotta know in the headphones, Sennheiser. They're as good as Bose. They're one of the premier brands of headphones around. Um, it even tells you stunning sound, sensational style. So they've got a nice leather headband. These are, these are nice. I've looked at them in there. Everything's in there, including the manual. It looks like the somebody looks like somebody looks like somebody returned them because they had buyer's remorse. And why would you have buyer's remorse on a set of headphones? Well, tell us, Beard. Come on, dude. Tell us. All right, so, well, first off, how do you know they had buyer's remorse? There you go. There's a return sticker from Amazon. So if y'all know what that is, that LPN sticker is a return sticker from Amazon. You got to have the whole story. I asked the lady, I'm like, ma'am, how much of these headphones? Ooh, damn, the light is terrible. Haha. <laughs> hey, I'm going to learn making videos yet. Light, light source behind you. So anyway, um, she said, "She said, what do you want to pay for them? That's a mistake. I've been hanging out with Harlan Tyree for a long time. Sometimes somebody needs a gut punch. I said, man, $10? She looked at me. She said, well, I think they're worth 50 or 60 I looked them up. I'm like, yeah, but they're an Amazon return. There's no guarantee they work. I'm taking a, a full chance that these things work. I test them. They work. <laughs> they sound awesome. Uh, and she's like, hmm. Give me the ten dollars and then she started thinking about it after i'd already paid her and i was looking at some other stuff because this flea market like every other flea market has, has just vomited amazon returns everywhere and you've seen every crazy brand that every private label person's ever made up in their entire freaking life uh you know and but you can dig and find stuff that doesn't mean don't look through the booths that doesn't mean check it out that means you've got to know what you're looking at you've got to know that sennheiser is a real brand uh something like y-e-e-p-a yeepa or something i just made that up would be a brand that somebody tried to make up because they know nobody else is using that title so yeah then she says maybe those were the 200 dollars ones i looked up <laughs> there's none for sale on amazon i showed a keep a chart and here comes the keep a chart now the last new pair fold for six hundred dollars. <laughs> so those two headphones alone are incredible, right, right, right. So I do buy things that sell at the auction. So uh, if anybody do not let anybody from the University of Alabama see this craziness, because uh, 
actually bought a Tennessee ball bag. And it is ugly. Got that damn dog Smokey on it. Yeah, I didn't even look in it. It looks like it's a little practice boss. Remember, I sell at a flea market. I'm, I'm sorry, I sell at an online auction. And uh, this is going to Tennessee. He said, yeah, there's something wrong with the handle. Uh, you know what's wrong with this handle? It's going to disappear. I'm just gonna, I'm just going to cut it off and throw it out. That's going to auction. Uh, paid $3. Three. All right, what else is in here? Uh, this I kind of like this picture it's man the, the value of my headphones is going down by the minute uh, so that picture is going to auction it is a it says live well y'all can read it freeze the screen if you want to read it that was two bucks all right what else we find in here with all the trouble bud lights in I'm gonna take the little four dollar sticker off there I ran some glasses a couple weeks ago. They did really well. They were Simpson glasses. So I'm like, I paid a dollar for these. I'm like, you know what? They'll go to the auction. They've never been used. Somebody will give me, you know, one bid. I'll make a couple of dollars. And yeah, so there we go. Some glasses there. Only other thing in this box is, do you guys know what these things are? Um, Yeah, if you grow marijuana or seedlings or, or if you're... It's an air garden. This is a nice one. I don't know what it's worth. I'll put it up on the screen. But yeah, these do well at the auction too. I, it depends on what they're worth. It might go on eBay, but it came with this. I paid three for it. It came with that too. Some Maybe I'll grow some tomatoes. Who knows? I doubt it. <laughs> and it came with this manual right here. Woo. So there you go. That's a good one there. Um, so what else do we have in here? Uh, Porter Cable, strong, strong brand for tools, and that is a Nike, Nike, lithium Nike ad. It's a lithium charger. Um, I got both chargers. What I pay six dollars a piece for them. There's the other one. For, so there's two different chargers there. I paid five for this guy. Uh, Panasonic eight track player. Uh, I got to test it. Um, I've got another one in there just like it. Um, the fellow who I bought it from, I, I know the guy. He's a really nice guy. Watches the channel. Um, so yeah, I, I need a, I need the adapter. See, I got a pair of these. I don't know where the other one went. Um, doesn't have the back on them. So I paid, uh, I paid eight dollars a piece for these Xbox One controllers. Those, those actually came with the, uh, the headphones too. That was another Amazon order. Maybe I'll keep up. Who knows? All right. I buy a lot of media. It's all these Big Bang Theory. Um, last time I ran a big lot of Big Bang Theory up at the auction. Did really well. And then there's a Blu-ray on top of it. So I don't know how many seasons I got. Uh, third, fourth, second, sixth, seventh, fifth. All right. One, two, three, four. Uh, six, seven, seven again. So, yep, I think there's like 11. And then these guys here, uh, Boy Meets World, uh, they were all new, and I've sold a, a set of these already. Um, but these things are worth 24 to 28 dollars a season, so uh, they, they were a dollar each, so those are good. And I don't know what that one's worth, I just picked it up because it's got Michael Jordan on it, it's the original Space Jam. All right, pet steps are five bucks. You can't go wrong with pet steps. I've got to wash the steps here in a minute. Uh, all right, I think I bought a rocking chair around here too. Let's see. Yeah, I, I bought this rocking chair here to go to the auction. It's, it was five bucks. Yeah, the dog stairs were five bucks. Anything up there? Bunch of junk, trash. Yeah, sorry, I was I was looking for something I lost. And I didn't find it. Imagine that. All right, there's a couple more things in the uh, in the bag and the box, and then we'll be all done. Here. All right, y'all hang out there. All right, so what are we? I paid a dollar for that. Um, it sells for $24, $25 the book. Uh, it's got one little, just a little, but it, I'll sell this in uh, very good condition on Amazon. 
Um, I got these bags of Legos for a dollar each. So they're, they're gallon size Ziploc bags. Um, I picked up some more movies. They were all a dollar each. They're all in Blu-rays. They're all new. Um, these are pretty interesting. I'm sending them to auction. My grandparents used to have these at $2 for the whole set. They were silver plate coasters. So yeah, those are pretty interesting. Never I bought this toaster for three dollars and it, it's never been used. It's I need to look it up. Um, it was originally cost twenty nine. That looks like an Ollie sticker. So I don't know what that's worth. But yeah, it's it's pretty cool. Star Trek is worth about twenty eight dollars. I paid three for it. Star Trek seen it. Not all these seen it are good, but if it's a sealed game, you got to look it up, right? Right, right. Um, and then I got a picture. I'm gonna send that to auction. It was five bucks. So we'll see how that does. Oh, there's a few more things. Um, so I'll pay ten dollars for that. If you know, you know. <laughs> if you know, you know. I've never seen a four pack, but there you go. What's going on eBay? And then I got all four of these, ten dollars each. They are worth about forty dollars a piece. Uh, there's the other two. And last but not least, um, I paid ten for that, and it is still sealed too so I think it's worth 40 on Amazon so yeah so I hope you guys had a had a great day at the sales the only other thing I picked up were myself personally I picked up a set of uh airpod twos the pro ones uh they were 60 bucks so uh, they're brand new sealed and yes they are real and yes I know how to tell the difference and it shows up in the phone that they are airpod twos and it shows when the warranty ends so Phone recognize them, so they got to be real, right? All right, so how did I do? Leave them in the comments. <clears throat> did I? Did you learn something? Did you learn about the brand Sennheiser? What about Razor? Did you look up them Clorox pens yet? <laughs> you had to learn about them, right? Uh, yeah, what else is in there? Right, right. All right, we'll see you in the next one. Or maybe Wednesday morning on the morning show. Hey, come join us. Talk to you in the next video. Roll Tide.